Well, the fallout continues over that scathing report blasting how Tennessee carries out death row lethal injections. This as a new person takes over the helm at the embattled agency that oversees those executions, the Tennessee Department of Correction. And the new commissioner comes from Arizona, whereas New Channel 5's Jason Lamb tells us there have also been a series of struggles with executions. It was in this social media video last week that we heard for the first time from the new head of the State Department of Correction about his vision for the agency. My vision is to bring us to new ideas, outside the box thinking, um, and trying to innovate new techniques and new correctional thoughts into the existing policies and procedures here in Tennessee. Frank Strada's boss, Governor Lee, touted his experience. Really grateful and excited about Commissioner Strada and his expertise uh, in correction. Part of that expertise came from Strada's role in Arizona, overseeing the person who directs death row executions there. But like Tennessee, Arizona has had a checkered history with its executions, including two executions just last year where medical technicians struggled to simply find a vein to inject the drugs into. It took the IV team quite a while to get uh, find a vein and they finally went into his femoral artery. At one point as all of this was going on, he looked through the glass and said, can you believe this? In another instance, the execution team had to resort to a bloody backup procedure known as a cut down to get into an inmate's groin. I believe that may have happened because one thing I did see was there was a small suture. Did you guys see a suture? There was a suture that they came through, so maybe they closed that cut. I didn't see the cut actually made, but I remember thinking, well, that's odd. Why are they suturing around there? So that would make sense. On top of that, a federal judge last year said Arizona's prisons violated the U.S. Constitution, operating with deliberate indifference to providing prisoners with adequate medical and mental health care. All as Tennessee now looks to change how it executes death row inmates with Strata at the helm. We want to make sure that we do it right and that we do it correctly and look at best practices across the country. Jason Lamb, News Channel 5.